one thing I had kind of had on my mind to do, but forgot to do. It was fill the level of gas at DJ. I did lift up the windscreen just a touch, because I'm going to be going on the highway. And the highway speed whips this helmet around like nobody's business. It's been a little drippy today, but not really bad. Last week there was such a heavy band of storms that went through. I have a neighbor down the street that has a flagpole with a don't tread on me flag and an American flag. His flagpole bent in one of the storms. And another cornfield wiped out by development. Welcome to Mannheim Township. Now, yeah, rolling forward isn't going to really help you much. Yeah, you, you just rolled off the sensor. Hmm, roads are a little wet here. First wet roads I've seen. Gotta watch for oily bits. One thing that I'm surprised at, even with the slightly forward seating position of this machine, it's so comfortable. I am a little nervous taking this because the place I'm going has some gravel. I, I have really been struck lately by the wondering over the meaning of it all. And I know in my heart the answers, but having had COVID and having been very sick and being told by a doctor that I was going to die, basically, we've been over that before, I find myself in a situation where my heart hurts and I want very badly to believe that my life has purpose. I know that there's a meaning for everything and that there's a purpose in everything. I spent ten and a half years of my life giving my life away to other people. But I don't know, is that enough? Is, it, is there more? Solomon wrote in Ecclesiastes that all is meaningless and vanity. Everything a man does in this life is pointless. And he goes on to say more. He actually sums it up with pointless if it's not done for the right reasons. And that if we just store up wealth and things and don't have a purpose other than to get those things, then there's no meaning in it. And I want my life to have meaning. I want it to be a purpose. One of the reasons I do this channel, that I get so frustrated when I post stuff that nobody sees it. It's not a pity party on me. I, I just don't know how to get more viewership without having to pay out the wazoo to get it. This is the little town of Brownstown, and you'd never know it, but about, I think it was about 15 years ago, there was a rather gruesome discovery in someone's backyard of a body that had been buried uh, a gruesome murder. I don't know which particular property it was, but every little town seems to have their weird stuff that's happened. I don't remember all the details about the murder. If I can find it, I'll link it. Now, hopefully this stretch has gotten rid of some of the grease that was on it. The last time I was through here, it was all greasy. And somebody's illegally turning. Not a cop car. These splotches where stuff and cars come up through, but it doesn't look as greasy as it was the last time I was here. I'm still not going to see stick to should have taken off my helmet cover. <laughs> oh, this is slidey. Yeah. We're not going to we're not going to come back this way. I'm trying very hard not to grip the handlebars too tight. Trying to relax. Hit a chunk, or somebody's like a whole lot of pot. <laughs> that was one thing that bothered me at the car show the other day, or the car, whatever. <sighs> Almost there. this particular road. It becomes a gravel road. Right up here. I've never had this on gravel. So here it goes. Oh. 
Okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to park. I didn't feel one of them on the other bike. <laughs> oh, it's so much different. Oh, oh, oh. like a washboard. Uh, I don't know if I'm taking the exact line, but oh, so much smoother. Uh, that will be point to the NT700V. It also did better with that speed hump. And now I enter into the realm that I didn't dare do on the NC700, and this is fine. I'll go around with this bit here. I don't know what it is about the smaller bikes, but it seems okay on these gravel bits. So long as I take my time with it. This road has been well packed, which helps. Yeah, not a problem. And back on the pavement. Into the road. 